Hey YouTube violinists, Eric here. Today's video is all about neck tension and how to release neck tension while you're playing the violin. Stick around to the end of the video. And if you're not subscribed, please make sure to hit the subscribe button, hit the bell notifications, because that way it helps the YouTube algorithm push this video out for people like you. It is true that you will experience some tension in your body. However, in today's video, it's all about learning how to release tension. I believe in violin playing that you are able to relax whenever it's necessary. So there will be moments in your in your violin repertoire where there may be a little bit of a stretch with your fourth finger and you know there might be a little bit of a tension there but um, it's all about learning how to release and relax that tension so but talking about specifically in the neck area our neck is a very sensitive area because if we do all sorts of different weird stuff that's not natural to us then we're going to experience a lot of pain so for instance something that we don't want to do is this we don't want to put our violin all the way down where we have a almost like a 90 degree angle with our head. Generally speaking, you want our head to be nice and straight, aligned with our spine, especially with our neck. And the rule of thumb is that if you're new to the channel and or if you're a returning uh, viewer, we always want the violin to come to the body. We never want the, the body to come to the violin. And this is a really easy quick tip for you to understand and to practice at home, especially in front of a mirror. I always encourage students, especially in this violent community, to practice in front of a mirror just because it gives you a visual sense of what's happening with your violin setup. So, you know, you could hold your violin with two hands here and see what is the most comfortable position. And, you know, for me, I have a long neck, so it's very um, easy to determine. I know I still have this little bit of space and I have other videos addressing, you know, shoulder, um, shoulder rest height, neck length, all that. But that's not for today's video. Today's video is just understanding how to relax. So if you are in your most natural state, if you're in your most natural position with your body, your shoulders should be nice and down. And I always like to talk about the lat muscle right over here, which is also a big part of our shoulder. I always like to have my students kind of relax these muscles and then as a result my shoulders and my shoulder blades are down and as a result my head is you know straight and my violin can go straight into my area where the shoulder is and for someone with a long neck like myself or if you have a long neck all you have to do is just simply maybe adjust whether it's the violin is too much to the left or to the right obviously we don't want to play with the violin too much here but we want the violin maybe, um, if you're a Suzuki violinist, then you know they'd always talk about no to scroll. That's fine too. As long as you're not squeezing with your chin. That's another common issue with beginner violinists is that we tend to squeeze with our chin. But if you notice, if you try it right now alongside with the video, if you squeeze with your chin, you're gonna experience a lot of pain in the back of your head where the neck meets the, the skull, where the neck meets the head. And you know, each body is different and everybody experiences pain and tension in, in different ways. But for me at least, and something that I've noticed in my students is that that's what happens, that we always take the chin rest too literally right here. So there you have it. That's your quick tip of the day when releasing neck tension. Leave your comments down below. What are some things that you find troublesome or something that you've been experiencing with neck tension? I wanna leave the conversation down below. I also have other videos addressing different kinds of issues with violin playing. Take a look at the playlist right over here and right over here to take a look at. Thanks so much and I'll see you in the next video.